So a few weeks ago, I was talking to one of my best clients. When we started working together, he was at 8K a month. Within 18 months, he had scaled to 100K a month. The problem is that he was in a little bit of a confidence crisis because at the 100K a month level, there had been some operational challenges that were in essence affecting his own mindset, belief system and performance. And this video is about the three specific mindset shift that we unlocked in one call together that help him scale past 100K a month. You can apply these three mindset shift at any level of business and I can guarantee they will help you have a much easier, fun business journey. Pay special attention to number two because it is something that doesn't get discussed enough, but it's absolutely key if you really want to succeed in business. Welcome back. My name is Leon Castillo, founder of Self Master Peak Performance Institute for Founders. We help them scale fast without any procrastination, burnout, and self belief problems. Now, this video is about three specific mindset shifts that you can apply at any level of business. The first one is systems mindset. And this more than a mindset shift really is a paradigm shift because this affects everything you do in your life. One, this ticks. When you finally internalize what I'm going about to say, everything is going to change for you. And here's the mindset shift. Everything is a system. The universe is systematic. And what does that mean? It means that everything is cause and effect. And every outcome you want in life is just the effect of a series of causes, a system that you can influence. No matter how difficult that goal might seem, no matter how far-fetched it may look, it's always the natural consequence of tweaking the necessary variables in order to get that outcome. And this is important because average entrepreneurs and any average performers, they don't really think systematically. So they do some random efforts, disconnected initiative that very seldom lead to the outcomes they want. But elite performers in sports, in the arts and business, they're very systematic about everything that they do, knowing that every goal is just one system away. Now that system can be very complex or very simple, but it's always one system away. For instance, Elon Musk is trying to get to Mars. That's a very complicated system to pull off, but within an enough time frame, he will eventually figure it out. It's just doing the necessary things in order to get that outcome. And how does this affect you? Well, if you're in business, whatever goal you're chasing is one system away. That system can be very complex with a lot of mirror subsystems, but it is, is always the same principle. You will get the outcome you want once you deserve it. And you deserve it by creating the perfect system that will give it to you. So my client was saying, hey, I don't know why, but we're making all of these mistakes and maybe I do not deserve to have a seven figure business. Maybe this is just too much for me. He said, hey, hey, wait, no. You just don't have perfect control of the system that are yielding right now 100K a month. So what is the solution? Double down on the efficiency of the system you currently have. How can you eliminate mistake? How can you make sure that every single one of the people in your team are delivering the client delivery excellence that you did in the past? Because his high cups were mostly related to client delivery. So instead of thinking that he was not good enough or that he was not ready for it, is hey, wait, what is the system that you need to improve in order to scale for a past honey camera. Now, before I go into mindset shift number two, like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss out on any of the juicy stuff that we publish every week. So mindset shift number two is very important, but not many people discuss it, but it's absolutely key. It is believing before you have evidence of that belief. What does that mean? It means that in order for you to do something, in order to execute a behavior, you need to believe that you are able to execute it. If you do not believe you can do something, you will never attend it. You cannot out behave your limited belief system. So in the specific case of my client, he had to believe first that he had to ability to fix the systems in his business in order to scale past 100K a month. He had to believe he had the ability to figure it out in order to figure it out. You first build a belief and then you act on it. Now, there's three levels to belief. One is wanting to do something, which is typically what average performers do and they very seldom get the outcomes they want. 
Second level is believing you can do it, but that is still not enough because when you believe you can do something, your conscious mind believes it, but typically your subconscious mind over which you have no control doesn't necessarily believe it too. So when the going gets tough, you typically self-sabotage. You believe you can get to 100k a month, but then when the operational challenges come, you go into a negative rut. That has happened to a lot of our clients and this is the things that we fix, the subconscious program that is colliding with their conscious desires. The last level is when you expect to get it. You believe something so intently, so strongly, that there's no doubt whatsoever in your mind. You just expect to win. And this is crucial. You have to embody a belief so deeply that you do the necessary things in order to get the outcome of that belief. You believe it consciously and you believe it subconsciously. You embody that belief. There must have zero, zero doubt in any fiber of your being. So believe before evidence, but believe the right way. Embody that belief. Be absolutely convinced that there's no other choice but to get it. And this is a constant among elite performers in sport, in arts, in business. It's always the same. You first convince yourself that you are destined for greatness before you become great. Not because you became great that you believe yourself that you are. No, that's just not how it works. Elite performers understand they first they build a belief and then they achieve what that belief allows them to. Which leads me to mindset shift number three, which is very subtle, but very important, which is not caring about the outcome. In other words, detaching from the outcome. And I know this seems counterintuitive because we just discussed how you need to embody the belief so strongly that you have zero doubts whatsoever that you're gonna get that. But at the same time, if you care too much about the outcome when you are performing whatever it is that you're performing, you will self-sabotage because your mind is going to run programs about every single detail that can go wrong until something goes wrong. And this is true across the board. When you obsess over outcome, you get performance anxiety. Imagine Usain Bolt in the finals of the Olympics, instead of absolutely expecting to win and detaching from the outcome, instead he was obsessively worried about not winning a gold medal. He will start scanning for threats, comparing himself with other runners, maybe thinking he's going to get injured or whatever, and that would have damaged his performance. But instead, the only thing he did was expect to win and not care about the outcome, which allowed him to achieve that gold medal. For my client, the specific protocol that we created was, now that you know that it's all a systems game and you need to build evidence before you get the outcome, you must be totally okay with things not going your way. Because in the beginning, the system you improve will not be perfect. So you're gonna have a few struggles until you figure it out. But instead of thinking that you will not figure it out, well, instead of having any sort of subconscious program running around in your head that may prevent you from dispassionately fixing the system, you show up every day, fix the system, tweak the variables until you surpass the level of business you're in. So in essence, these three mindset shifts are absolutely fundamental. This is what elite performers had embedded in their own subconscious to allow them to scale. First, everything is the system. So if you want an outcome, figure out what are the causes and the processes that you need to master in order to get that outcome. That's it, no magic involved whatsoever. But also you need to become a good system operator by building belief before evidence, believing in something so deeply that your behavior naturally reflects that belief system. But you should not self-sabotage when you're performing the action by caring too much about an outcome that ultimately you don't have 100% of control over all the time. In the long run, you always get what you deserve, but in the short term, you may have not the result you want. And that's okay, because you're gonna tweak the system, you're gonna try again, and in the end, you will get it, right? So I hope this three mindset shift help you. This applies to everything, it applies to you know school, university, business, personal relationship, fitness, it doesn't matter. You build a system, you believe you can operate it, and you detach from the outcome. And if things don't go your way, you fix, you tweak, you improve until you eventually get it. 
So I hope this was useful. If you want more protocols and more training, book a call with us. But in the meantime, apply these three mindset shifts because they are guaranteed to help you elevate your performance like nothing else. See you in the next video.